And there's a record store here called the Virginia Record and Tape Exchange. It's a new shop and it had punk stuff. And the, on their magazine rack, we're looking through it, and there was a fanzine that had Penelope on the cover from the Avengers. And we're like, whoa, like, what is this? Because that's like, we were a huge Avengers fan. So when we saw the Avengers on the cover of this magazine, like just bought it and it was touch and go. It wasn't the first time, but it was one of the earliest, like other scenes we became aware of that was sort of on our level. When we put the Teen Idols record out in December of 1980, we sent out a handful of records to be reviewed. And one of them went to touch and go. I guess Tesco and Dave got the record and it was broken in half. But the cover, which is my brother's hand with the X's on it, and all of us stand together on the back, it was engaging enough that they took the record and taped it together and tried to play it. And what they could make, it was not playable, but what they could hear made them write us back and say, can we get another copy? And that's really the beginning of my relationship with the Midwest, which of course then ends up leading us to Detroit. Take no shit to 